Other People's Moods is probably the most top tier childhood trauma survivor trigger that I can think of. And I want you to think about which which of these two patterns, there's two kind of wirings that happen around for childhood trauma survivors who grew up with extremely moody parents or tragic parents or aggressive parents, is we can be wired to overly take responsibility for the other person's mood, to be overly empathic, to really, our inner child really believes that we caused it. We don't really know how. We don't really know, we don't really care how, but we definitely are convinced that we caused it on a deep level. That's one set of wiring. The other set of wiring is to be reactive and defensive against somebody else's mood. Like that's when we might be persecuted by the person's mood would be the next sort of step. So we might, what's what's your problem kind of, kind of energy. So those are the two wirings. And I want you to kind of pause and think right now is if you identify, you can be both, but if you identify with more than one or the other, where might that come from growing up?